It's Monday, the 3rd of October. I'm Erin Bates, and these are your leading stories. The Minister of Higher Education and Training, Bladen Zamande, is expected to hold a multi stakeholder meeting in Emperor's Palace, Kimpton Park, today. Its aims to solve the crisis in higher education and resume the academic program for 2016. On Saturday, Nzamande said officials in higher education had met with student leaders. They discussed weeks of sometimes violent protest at institutions of higher learning. A handful of universities are expected to resume their academic program today, including the University of Cape Town and the University of Witwatersrand, but amid heavy security presence. Netvac 24 reported on Sunday that there is no trace of the home loan President Jacob Zuma is said to have acquired to pay back for non-security upgrades at his home state in Gandla. VBS Mutual Bank claims to have lent Zuma 7.8 million rand for the property, which is on an earth he does not own. However, no such bond has been registered in Zuma's name at the deeds office. According to law, a home loan must be registered at the office. In the past, Zuma said he had an F&B home loan for Ngandla, but the bank said a bond for Zuma would have been impossible since he does not have the title deed. And finally, the seaside hamlet of Hermanus came alive this weekend for the annual Whale Festival. Family-friendly activities, seafood and loads of fresh air along with the splashing tails of southern right whales were the order of the weekend. The old harbour area in Hermanus is said to be one of the best land-based whale watching spots in the world. Visit Traveller24 for pictures of the massive mammals from the festival over the weekend and go to News24 for more on these and other news stories throughout the day.